I'm a reckless scallywag who has no ability to see the long-term consequences of my actions. How you doing? You're intimidated by me, and I am absolutely relishing it. I seem to have this calming effect on you, and you're not sure why, but you love it. Mm. If I just keep it superficial, then I won't have to deal with the reality of how meaningless my short-term systems are. Try to understand me if you want, but I won't let you in. <laughs> you never know where you stand with me, <laughs> but I somehow expect you to. <laughs> yeah, I have this brilliant brain full of knowledge, but I'm not going to share any of it with you. I'm going to take it to my grave and deprive humanity of all the brilliant discoveries that I've made. Blah, 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 kerfuffle, kerfuffle, surface level chit chat, broad claim with no evidence. You're willing to overlook how pedantic and structured I am because I'm the only one who seems to understand your profuse disdain for all things emotional. Just nod and smile a whole lot as I talk to you. That way you won't have to say something that's inevitably going to offend me. I agree with everything you're saying, man, but I seem to think of important social issues as a joke and I'm shockingly composed for someone who knows that we're plunging into complete political and economic doom. I'm too sweet to be real. There must be something lurking underneath the surface that will explode at any minute. Try provoking me and see if it comes out. It's me, that version of you that comes out when you're having a little bit too much fun at the party. You pretend to hate me, but really you love me because I am you. There's no point trying to fight it. Embrace your inner ESFP. I find solutions to things much faster and more accurately than you do. Then I actually apply those solutions, which you rarely do. And I seem not to care about your opinion of me. These things frustrate you. I am an insufferable know-it-all, and that means that I couldn't possibly be an INTJ. Prepare for discomfort, as I ruthlessly probe at your personal life. 